From Darkness to Light, The Redemption of a Satanic Priest, Unlocking the Potency of the Holy Rosary and Novena to Our Lady of Pompeii. The city of Pompeii as it is known today is as a result of the tireless work of Bartolo Longo and he promoted the daily rosary and novena to Our Lady of Pompeii. A powerful novena that I and many Christians all over the world have attested to its efficacy. The story of Bartolo Longo illustrates that no one is beyond redemption especially with the help of Virgin Mary, the mother of all Christians. Who is Bartolo Longo? He was born into a devout Catholic family in 1841, Longo initially embraced his faith. However, as a young man, he became disillusioned and strayed from his religious upbringing, ultimately falling into the clutches of the occult. His fascination with mediums and witchcraft led him to participate in many seances. Engulfed in a world of moral decay and spiritual darkness, his life became full of depression anxiety and confusion and was in desperate need of consolation and relief. Eventually these spiritual, psychological, and emotional problems led him to seek out the help of a devout Dominican priest, Father Alberto Radente. Bartolo confessed that he had become a servant of the devil and a priest of Satan. Father Alberto Radente instructed him in the faith, helping him turn from the occult and renounce his involvement in spiritualism. Before encountering the saving grace of the Virgin Mary through the Rosary, Longo grappled with intense feelings of despair and even experienced suicidal inclinations. However, through the transformative power of the Rosary and the intercession of Our Lady, Longo found solace and renewed hope. The Rosary became his lifeline, leading him away from despair, he began to experience peace as he prayed the rosary and offered himself totally to the care of the Virgin Mary. With newfound zeal and devotion, Longo dedicated himself to promoting devotion to the rosary and the Blessed Virgin Mary. He tirelessly spread the message of hope and salvation to all who would listen, embodying the redemptive power of God's love. On October 26, 1980, Longo was beatified by Pope John Paul II, who called him the Apostle of the Rosary a testament to the miraculous transformation wrought by God's grace in the life of a once wayward sinner. His life continues to inspire countless individuals worldwide, offering hope to those who may have strayed from the path of righteousness, and reminding them that no one is beyond the reach of God's mercy and love.